Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to episode one of EPW. What the world? Oh! Oh! The shield attacking Eric Bischoff and Kyle O'Reilly? Oh, we finna have a dream match. Off rip. The Shield versus the Street Profits. To kick off EPW Neutron. Oh, man. Tension's already flaring episode one. Ring that bell, ref, and here we go. Seth and Montez Ford starting to soft. Montez planting them with the rock bottom. And now Tess. Oh! Dropping Seth right on the top of his head with that DDT. Now Seth. Back in control now. And now Tess able to get out of whatever. Seth was looking for there, and now, oh, kind of like a little judo throw there from Seth. And now, oh, those back elbows from Montez Ford, and now uh, an abdominal stretch from Tez, and now, oh, Ambrose able to break it up, and now Seth landed in the Montez Ford with the rolling elbow. And now Seth taking flight. Oh, no water in the pool and a standing moonsault from Ted. Oh, he's going for another. He's looking for a shooting star press there. But Seth was able to get the knees up. And now Seth with a snap suplex on the floor. And now Seth sending. Montez Ford back into the ring. And oh, and in comes Big Angelo Dawkins. Running Bulldog off ripping. Seth is already busted open as Ambrose getting his first action here in AP here in EPW. Oh my gosh. Seth is leaking right now. As now Dean able to hit that swinging neck breaker. And now Dawkins tossing Ambrose like a rag doll. And now Dawkins. Oh! Just tossing Ambrose. And now Ambrose is still going to take a breather. Oh! Dawkins tried a cheap shot on Seth. Oh! And he paid the price for it. And back in comes Seth. Oh my gosh, Seth is going to need like 15 staples after this match is over and done with. As Seth connects with that drop kick, hooks the leg on Dawkins in a kick out. Tez would have broke it up if Dawkins didn't kick out. As this is vintage Seth, we haven't seen Seth do that in a while. Small package driver. And now Seth, oh, going after Tez. Oh. And Ambrose and Dawkins going at it on the outside now. Back suplex on the floor. That is hard concrete under that. And now Seth getting back to the ring. Going right back after Montez. This match is breaking down. This match is really breaking down now. They just don't care. And now Seth. Irish whipping Dawkins into the corner. And there's a forearm. And running form smash in the corner. Dawkins looked like he was trying to make a... Hot tag to Montez Ford. And now Seth up top. Frog Splash. Hooks the leg on Dawkins. Two. No. 
Dawkins able to get that shoulder up. And now Seth, oh, tried a single leg drop kick, couldn't connect. And now Dawkins looking to work over the arm of Seth Rollins. And now Dawkins, oh, like he was trying to make a tag, Seth was trying to stop him. But in comes Montez Ford. And Seth, oh, just beat him to the punch. Montez fighting out of it. And now Seth the kick to the gut. And now dragging him to the corner. Oh, and Taz again. Able to get out of whatever Seth was looking for. Snapmare down. <laughs> Hesitation drop kick. Hooks the leg. Oh, and a rope break. Oh, vicious right hand and a no, another one to, to Ambrose there. As, oh, right to the ref. As Seth to the corner and another forearm. Oh, wait, what? Oh, what? A springboard. Oh, my gosh. A springboard curve stomp? Are you joking, bro? Oh, that would have been raps. That would have been raps. Oh my gosh. And now Seth with a flatliner. Now stomping on the arm of Montez Ford. And now, boom, revolution knee. Hooks the leg on Montez Ford. Oh. And now, Seth looking for something. Oh, and a chop block from Tez. Rock bottom. And now tag, in comes Dawkins. Spear! Hooks the leg. One, two, and Ambrose was able to break it out. And break it up. And now Dawkins was looking for something. Seth able to counter, and now gut buster. And now tag in comes Ambrose. And now Ambrose is able to dodge whatever Dawkins is looking for. Pile driver was sitting. Oh my gosh. This ain't WWE no more. We can do pile drivers here, man. Oh. And Dawkins playing them. Spine Buster hooks the leg and Seth able to break it up. What a start to EPW Neutron, man. Two of the best tag teams of all time. What the heck are they looking for here? Oh, oh my gosh. Little tandem. Tandem offense there from Tez and Dawkins as Dawkins on the wrong side. And into the corner goes Ambrose. What is Tez looking for? Rolling Thunder Frog Splash! And Tez going up top. Seth looking to try for something in from the heavens. Montez forward and Seth able to break it up. And now, oh, Seth's going to pay the price with the scoop slam. And now, oh, hold up now. Uh-oh. Montez looking to... No way. Suicide. Oh! Ambrose able to, able to counter with that right hand. And now sitting over the top by Montez Ford. 
and tag in comes Dawkins and now he's looking to go for something and Ambrose caught him with a knee and a stomp right to the gut and Ambrose now going to work and oh fireman's carry discus punch to Dawkins and our neck breaker on the floor now Ambrose tagging in Seth is a count of eight now Seth going up to Tez count of nine and Dawkins Barely able to beat the count. And now, stand in sure, Nori. Seth, kick to the gut. Pedigree. Why isn't he going for the cover, man? <laughs> Dawkins is clearly out. And right into the corner. And now, what are they going for here? Tag team offense and a double foot stump to the back. And Ambrose going after Tez. They love going after Montez Ford. And now Ambrose going to the top. Telling Tez to get up as Dawkins is sent back to the ring. And Ambrose has other plans now. Oh. Elbow to the gut. And planted. Dawkins showing off that power. And now. Into the cut. Oh, and now Ambrose is busted open. What the heck are they looking for here? A little. Oh. Close on the corner. Oh, my gosh. Dawkins. Just exploded there, and in comes Seth off the hot tag. And Seth, schoolboy super kick, a.k.a. Harry Potter. And now Seth raining down the punches, and now Montez is busted open. Everybody is split open in this match now. As that's a form, another springboard curb stomp hooks the leg, and again, Dawkins able to break it up. Seth going to the top. And oh, was looking for an elbow drop there. Oh, DDT spiking Seth again. And in comes Dawkins. Once more, Spear again hooks the leg on Seth. Ambrose, oh no, Seth able to get the shoulder up. And now, what is Dawkins looking for here? Was going for something. Seth able to get out of it. Oh, knee right to the gut. And now, gut wrench suplex. And tag in comes Montez. Oh, what a drop kick. Bro, I need a little bit of water there, man. Oh, my gosh. <clears throat> and Seth looking for a curb stop. Bang! Spiking Montez for and again, Dawkins is right there to break it up. We have a five-star match on our hands as Montez rolls him up. Dawkins distracted the ref by mistake. And Seth was able to kick out. If it wasn't for that slight distraction, maybe the Street Profits would have got the win there. And now a little, little face... Forearm rakes there from Tez. And up the hole. 
single leg drop kick from Seth Rollins. <laughs> and now tag in comes Dean. What the heck are they looking for here? Oh! Big boot. Oh my gosh! Close line. Ambrose back to his feet. Counter by Tez. Oh, we're right in. And now Montez for can he connect this time? Oh, Dawkins just ruined the spot, bro. And Dawkins threw it threw Ambrose back into the ring. That's what to call him Andrews. And now back into the corner tag. In comes Dawkins. What the heck, Spine Buster? Frog Splash from Dawkins! Hooks the leg. One, two, and oh, Tez couldn't get there to stop Seth. And Seth sent to the outside. Oh, my goodness, man. Dawkins to the top went for another frog splash. Ambrose able to counter dirty deeds. Hooks the leg. One, two, and a kick out. The crowd chanting tag team wrestling. This has been a wonderful start to what may be the next great professional wrestling company. Oh, that is EPW. And now Montez possibly looking for that blockbuster. Connects! Running blockbuster hooks the leg and set again. And Montez again, probably looking for from the heavens. Hooks the leg again and again. Seth gets involved to break it up. When will this match end? Ambrose playing possum. Rolls them up. Two and a kick out. Well, oh, a breakup by Dawkins. And now uh, scoop slam. Oh, Dawkins and Seth, like, they're about to go at it on the outside. Montez in the zone right now, over the top, no! Ambrose able to get out the way. It's just pure chaos. Oh! Look out! Oh, face first goes Dawkins! Oh my gosh, repeated forearm shots from Ambrose. And Ambrose just again repeated forearm shots. And now the knees. Oh, one to the face. And Montez is staggered. This update is ready to start. I don't care, bro. I'm trying to call a match. <laughs> And now a neckbreaker. Swinging neckbreaker from Ambrose. Is he looking for dirty deeds again? Got him. Hooks the leg. Will this do it? No. Ambrose heading up to the second rope diving elbow. Nobody home. We know the problems that El that Ambrose has had in that elbow in the past. And out the hole. A uppercut to the back. This match has been gone on for almost 20 minutes. As Seth connects with the Enzigiri. And now working over the leg of Angelo Dawkins. Slowing down the pace. In this match. 
And I saw oh, stomp right to the midsection. Kick to the face from Dawkins. A spine buster! Hook cover! And a kick out. Oh my gosh, man. Oh, like Tez was thinking about going after Andrews. Not Andrews. Ambrose there. I've been playing too much Madden, bro. And a rope break there. Oh my gosh. And Tez heading up top. Looking for something crazy. Oh, and Seth able to counter. Sending Tez back into the ring. And now Dawkins, oh, with a cheap shot. A cheap shot to Seth. And now into the corner goes Seth. Oh my goodness, what a super kick. Oh my gosh, bro. Oh my goodness. And now dragging screw. Oh my goodness, what a clothesline. Now. Oh my goodness. Ambrose. Looking for some old, old form. Oh, psycho Larry. And now, another Dirty Deeds by Ambrose. And again, Montez breaking it up. This may be the last time I do just regular tag team match. I might just start doing tornado tags, man, because this is taking forever. 22 minutes this match has been going on. Oh, my gosh. Now, oh, cross face, cross face. Maybe that'll do it. Will he tap out? Oh, my gosh. Tez able to break it up. And now, Seth. Oh, that, well, the steps pretty much ruined his momentum there as he connects with the neck breaker, planning Dawkins on the floor. Now, Seth lighting up Dawkins with a super kick combo. And now, Sent. Oh, oh, oh my gosh. Sent just no sold it like it was nothing and got put right back down. As Daniel with a cheap shot and paid for it. And now Dawkins delivers a vertical suplex. Hooks the leg on Seth. Two and a kick out. I mean, they have a chance to put this match away with Ambrose out on the floor. And I think Montez is going to look just for that right now. Looking again for the rolling thunder frog splash. Bang! Hooks the leg, but Seth has got resiliency. Will he use it? He will. Hooks the leg. Oh, now hooks the leg. Kicks out like that. 
This match has been all over the place. As Montez again, another stunner. They love doing that. As in comes Dawkins. And Dawkins, oh. Dawkins was looking for a clothesline. Seth somehow was able to stay on his feet after Dawkins whiffed that. And kidney shots to the back of Seth. Hooks the leg on Seth. Oh, and a kick out. A kick out by Seth freaking Rollins. And now, oh. Oh my gosh, what an NZ. And now, oh, forearm. Oh, bulldog. Bro, I just noticed I had the volume all the way up, bro, on my TV. I hope that didn't mess with the audio. <laughs> if that did, I would be so pissed, bro. But back to the action. Oh, Ambrose connecting with that clothesline. And tag. In comes Seth. And now Seth. And I was looking for a clothesline there. And now got Dawkins up. And planting him. Oh. Oh, rolling out the way from the drop kick. And now. Oh. With the elbows from Dawkins. Oh. And now, looking for a small package driver. And now, Seth, Seth just allowed the tag. Something just popped into his head. But then, Montez delivered a chop block. Oh, DDT. Tez going up top from the heavens. Nobody home. And a tag... In comes Andrews, uh, Andrews Ambrose, bro. Why do I keep calling him Andrews, bro? Oh, a jumping DDT, and Ambrose able to roll out, and a Ken. with that little rope stunner. I mean, this match is really broken down now. Hesitation drop kick. Oh my gosh. This match has been going on for almost 30 minutes now. And oh, Ambrose sent flying. I hope you're willing for them to settle for a count out. Please, someone win this match. This is only match number one of EPW Neutron, man. And after, oh. Oh. And now Ambrose signaling that this is over. And Dawkins is stunned. He's on the floor. Tag. In comes Seth. What the heck are they looking for here? Oh, make a wish. So wishbone right there. Looking to snap. Test like a twig. And Seth again. A third springboard curb stomp. No, don't break it up. Come on.
Seth. Just looking for something. Looking to probably drag him to the corner again. Oh, corkscrew back elbow. Hooks the leg on Seth. Will this do it? Yes, it will. And the Street Profits, a.k.a. Street Business, with with Bobby Lashley and, and Carmelo Hayes and company, get the night started with the first win in EPW history. Job well done. Very well deserved. A valiant effort by the Shield. They just came up short. That says is going nuts. Dawkins is like, bro, what are you doing? A five star classic. And here we go, man. Some of you may know them. Some of you may not, but if you played WWE 2K22, you know Hector Flores and Paragon J. Pierce very well. They have made their debut now here in EPW looking for some tag team gold. As this is a number one contenders match for the EPW Tag Team Championships here on EPW Neutron. I forgot the names that I, I forgot what I called the titles, man. I gotta I gotta remember the title names because I named I named them some crazy stuff, man. But this should be a banger. And this is this is a tornado tag team match because I'm not gonna sit through another regular tag team match, bro. That was brutal. And here we go, man. Shoes, shoes, please. Oh, thank you, Chad Gable and Otis Alpha Academy. Looking. To make their mark here in EPW as well. Vince McMahon ended up firing them. I hope that doesn't happen in real life. Well, he can't really fire them in real life because he's not really in charge. But hope it doesn't happen in real life. These two get fired. These two are so brilliant in the ring and backstage, man. <clears throat> like their chemistry is top notch. They may, they may be all fun and games outside of the ring, but once they step into the squared circle, they are all business. And this should be a good one. The vets versus somewhat of the rookies in the professional wrestling world. The Disciples of Darkness... Versus Alpha Academy. Here we go. Oh. Oh, man. Otis. Not wasting any time lighting up Hector. And oh. Showing off his power at all planet. Alpha Academy. Taking control here early. And now looking for military press slam. Is Otis. And planted. I mean, this has been all Alpha Academy from the opening bell. Oh my gosh. They are absolutely dominating. The oh no. Oh my gosh. A bulldog right into the LED board on the side of the apron. And now hanging him up on the apron face first. As we going back into the ring. Hector and Gable all in. Gable, small package, rolling him up. One, two, and all. And again, look at the power of Otis with a military press slam. Oh! 
little tiger bomb action from Chad Cable in the ring. And what is Hector thinking here? Hector, oh, a little arm drag. A little, a little arm drag action, man. And look at all springboard hair corner on a Hector showing off his athleticism. He does come from a Lucha Libre background. The son of El Mago. A Mexican legend. Oh. And a cover by Otis and a kick out. And now Otis with an Irish whoa went for an Irish whip. Oh my gosh. Oh, oh went for a spinning back fist. Oh my gosh, man. This is this has been a wild one. Hooks the leg. One oh. And now the oh. hole. Little drop kick there. And now looking to work over the arm of Otis oh, little Fujiwara arm bar stretch. Oh, knee right to the face of Gable. Looking to hook the leg here. To advance to next week now. Who will get a tag team title match opportunity next week? And now looking to fly over the top, Hector. And now Jay Pierce as well. The disciples of darkness are rolling here. Oh. Oh my gosh, I've never seen that in this game this year. Well, both both teammates go flying back to back. That is incredible. They did their thing with this game. That ain't gonna lie to you. Still some some spots where they could have improved, but they they really have have um did their thing each and every year besides um WWE 2K20, which it was a monstrosity man a disaster of a video game as cable will try small package on the floor it's not gonna work but he's not fall count falls count anywhere man a little schoolboy super kick we saw Seth do that earlier and we saw him do this as well revolution knee oh well strongest slam from Otis cover on Hector and a kick out Oh, another revolution knee from Paragon, Jay Pierce. Oh, now Jay Pierce over the top again. Tope, Con, Hilo. And now. Oh, my gosh. That clothesline could have been dangerous with the back of his head hitting. About to hit the, the steps and tag Gable just playing mind games with Hector. Dragon twist cutter on the floor. Oh, and a German suplex from Hector Flores. And now Hector looking for a Pele kick. Dropping Chad Gable. Gable's in deep trouble right now. Belly to belly on the outside from Otis. Oh! Oh, what a forearm shot! The back of the neck and then a German from Gable. Gable taking it to both members of the Disciples of Darkness. And now, oh! Oh my gosh. Getting lit up. Hector Shin and Otis back to the ring and a kick to the gut. To get one a forearm shot right to the kidney. And they are just lighting up Gable right now. And now Otis comes to his rescue. After just watching him get his butt beat for the past 20 minutes, bro. <laughs> and now, boom! Little fisherman buster on the floor. 
standing shooting star prat on oh, no, no, I wasn't shooting. I was a moonsault. My bad. And boom, revolution knee again. A lot of crazy offense. Schoolboy super kick again. You should have hit him again. He's almost stunned. And now looking for Falcon's arrow. On the floor. How many revolution knees are we going to see tonight? We've already seen like 10. The, la the We're only in, in the first two matches of the night. Oh my goodness, man. And raking the eyes of Otis. And now both of them looking to turn their attention to Chad Gable. Never mind. Little old went for a German. Jay Pierce able to counter. Now Gable. Oh, I think I know what he's going for. Is he looking for Chaos Theory? Is he looking for Chaos Theory? He is. Can he connect? He does! And a power bomb on the floor from Otis. Hooks the leg on Paragon J. Pierce. Otis stopped him. Oh my gosh! Order of first scuba slab as J. Pierce was able to kick out a chaos theory. Not many have. Not many have kicking out of that very move. And now, Gable up top, Moonsault, nobody home. Jay Pierce was able to get out of the way and delivers a massive forearm shot to the back of the neck. Oh, and Otis wisely getting back in the ring because this might have been it. He locks him in the cross face and Otis able to break it up. And a coast line delivered. And now Otis sizing him up now. Looking for another slam, though. No. Oh, need a gut. Oh, what a headbutt. German suplex. Back and forth, these two teams go. Super kick. Oh, he's starting to roll with another one. Standing corkscrew shooting star press. Hooks the leg on Chad Gable and a kick out. Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness, bro. Hooks the leg on Otis now. To advance to next week and a kick out. I don't, I'm not sure if, if Jay Pierce broke that up by mistake. Or if he actually kicked out Snapdragon. The corner and now monkey flip. Oh man. Gable heading to the top, telling Hector to get back to his feet. Crossbody! Hooks the leg on Hector Flores and a kick out. Oh man. Gable, Irish whipping him into the corner, looking possibly for Chaos Theory. Once again, counter from Hector. And Hector's going to Irish whip him off the ropes, drop down, lead frog. Oh, an arm drag. Hooks the leg and Otis saying, uh-uh, I ain't having that. And now... Looking for another world strongest slam, and that took a lot out of Otis. Excuse me, nobody gonna cover him. Northern Lights now hooks the leg on Hector, and Jay Pierce breaks it up. I'm pretty sure Hector probably would have kicked out anyway with resiliency as he breaks up the pinfall right there. Oh, counter. Now Hector delivered a forearm shot. 
to Chad Gable now slowing down the pace. Working over the leg and Jay Pierce another forearm shot. Oh, Hector is looking for that moon saw and a rolling Wilk. Whoa! Somehow no sold the rolling will kick and now looking for chaos theory again This time the Hector Flores Bridges and a kick out Oh my goodness in a German Oh and a forearm smash now from Jay Pierce J. Pierce Irish whipping Gable off the rope sling blade hooking the leg on Chad Gable will that do it it will and the disciples of darkness are heading to EPW Neutron next week to face the champs for the tag titles what a match yeah I'm gonna definitely start start doing a lot more of the um Tornado tag matches Because that that was way better than than the um The um Regular tag matches Hector is absolutely gushing right now Holy but we're on to match number three <clears throat> Here we go this was originally supposed to be a tag team match, but now it's turned to a one-on-one, -on -one and we're starting off hot and heavy. Brutus Creed just beating the crap out of Sami Zayn. And they couldn't wait. Oh, my gosh, Brutus Creed just pouncing Sami Zayn. Oh, my gosh. What a start to this match. Holy. Oh, went for a, a standing senton there. And now, oh, Sammy. Oh, my gosh. This match is all over the place already. Fall and drop kick from Sammy. And now, Sammy with a vertical suplex there. Oh, oh, chop, punch, super kick. Sammy heading up top and Brutus Creed back on his feet. Oh, delivers a right. Tomahawk chop. What was that? A blind go? I think it was Tomahawk chop. Hooks the leg and a kick out. Oh. And now, forearm smash. To the back, up to the kidney area of Sami Zayn, and now all chop. Brutus Cree working over the leg, knows that Sami loves to hit that halluva kick. He can't hit it if he can't get a running start. Oh, and again was looking for that springboard tornado DDT. Could not connect. And I'll stomp to the head. My goodness. Oh. This has been back and forth. I was going for a knee hair con right out of there from Sammy. And a suicide dive. Tope Suicida. Oh my goodness. Oh. Oh. And now a punch from Sami Zayn. And another one to Brutus Creed. Back in the ring, go Sammy. Oh, Sammy, tell him to get back in the ring so we can finish this. 
Oh, and a snap German bridges into the cover, hooks a leg. Well, not didn't, didn't hook the leg, but you know. Sammy tell him to get back to his feet. Sammy starting to pick up the pace. He is feeling it. Sammy with the fallen drop kick again. Sammy feeding off the EPW universe. Hooks the leg on Brutus Creed in the kick out. And now Sammy went for oh. Went for a stand a Luva kick and a blue thunder bomb. Blue thunder bomb. Will that do it? No. A kick out from Brutus Creed. Oh. Little the right hand knee to the gut. Creed turned him around. Got him up. What is he looking for? Oh. Torture rack slam and a rope break. Oh, uh, we know what Brutus looking for here. Looking for a Brutus ball, possibly. Never mind a splash. About a halfway across the ring. I thought he was going for a Brutus ball. Holy. Oh, and this time, third time's a charm. Able to connect with that, that standing seated senton. And now, just cranking the neck of Sammy, trying to slow down the pace of this match. And again, delivering that senton. And Sammy just trying to catch his breath now. Trying to catch a breather. Delivers a back elbow. And now reverse DDT on the floor. Back and forth with the DDT. Oh my gosh, bro. Almost dropped my keyboard. Back and forth. They go. And now Sammy looking again was going for that big boot. They they gave him that for some reason. Another version of a halluva kick. As Sammy with the leaf off snap German again. This has been an incredible match between these two. I, th I feel like this match was slap in real life as well. As Sammy delivers clothesline to the back. And kick to the gut looking for a fisherman suplex. Fisherman suplex. And Sammy possibly signaling for the end. Never mind gonna deliver some punches a ground and pound. And now Irish whip into the corner. Sammy with the exploder. Exploder in the corner. Oh, need a gut. Sammy again. No, oh, forearm. Oh, and I think Brutus is busted open too. I think his nose got busted open. And from the top diving elbow, no water in the pool. Nobody home. And oh my gosh, just sent Sammy to the outside. And telling Sammy to get back up to his feet. Oh, diving double axe handle. This has been incredible, man. Oh, man. And now, oh, snap German again for the third time in this match. And another DDT. And a throw. And now, looking for a shoulder power bomb there from Brutus Creed. 
Oh, and now just <laughs> going crazy on Sami Zayn. We're at a count of eight. Brutus getting back into the ring. Count of nine. And Sammy getting back in the ring. Oh my goodness, what a spine buster. Hooks the leg on Sammy Zayn and a kick out. This has been a crazy match here tonight between these two. Brutus Creed heading up top. Oh, and Sammy got out the way. Knee to the gut. Oh! Little shoulder, shoulder tackle there. And, oh my gosh, what a close line. Delivered by Brutus. Will this time, will he be going for the Brutus ball? I think it's time, ladies and gentlemen. It's a Brutus, no! Oh, and Sammy able to get out the way. And ran right into a halluva kick. Hooks the leg on Brutus Creed. That may do it, and it will. What a match. Sammy is victorious. Oh, my gosh. I was not expecting that match to be that wild. Electric Pro Wrestling has kicked off with a bang. Man, oh man. Sami Zayn. One of the best in WWE now. He's one of the best here at EPW. On to our next match. And here comes the new team of Ricochet and Wesley. Now, this team, I, I'm managing them. It's part of my faction here in the EPW. But this is a unique team between two of the most electric superstars here in the EPW. They're so quick, they're so agile. And they're here to make a statement here early. <clears throat> Enough of the nice antics. It's time to get down to the nitty gritty and start getting mad, start getting angry, start getting absolutely disrespectful and dominant to get what you want here in pro wrestling, man. You gotta take what you want nowadays. It's not going to be given to you. And that's exactly what these two have realized. So I've taken them under my wing. And they're looking to show everybody here tonight why they should be feared by everyone in the locker room. Here comes the team of Joe Gacy and Karrion Cross representing the Wyatt Five. It would be the Wyatt Six, but they, they don't have six slots on 
the um, faction thing for some reason. Should be able to put as many people in the faction that you want, but can't. So I have to settle with the Wyatt Five. Let's <clears throat> cross. Joe Gacy making their way to the ring. Two guys that are feared themselves. Joe Gacy wasn't really getting anywhere down in the next T in WWE. Carrying Cross got lost in the shuffle on SmackDown. So I decided to bring them here where they can be showcased as a team. <clears throat> Here we go. Ring the bell and we're underway. And oh my gosh, Cross is on that power already. Oh, rolling for him from Ricochet. I'm rooting for my guys, man. A Fujio armbar locked in already. Already. And whoa. Oh, I've never seen that counter before. Cross was able to get out of that uniquely in a German. And now Ricochet and Wesley both on the same page. A little tag team action there. A little tandem offense. Oh, what a clothesline. Alley bomb from Ricochet. And tilt to world head scissors. Look out, suicide dive. Wesley taking it to the skies. And again, another. Superstar busted open on the show tonight. Oh my goodness, bro. Every match, somebody's bleeding. This is getting like AEW now, and I don't like it. And now, Irish whip to the corner. And now Irish whip to the other opposite corner. Oh, flying Mayorana. And another one to cross. And a knee from Ricochet. Stomp right to that calf. And now looking for a suplex is Joe Gacy. Ricochet able to get out of it. And a chop block. Chop block. And now look at Wesley on the outside. Man, Wesley and Ricochet look pretty darn impressive here. And Ricochet with the 630. Already making a statement. One, oh, what? A rope break in a tornado tag team match? Bro, are you kidding me? Bro, that was lights out. And Ricochet got him all. Oh. Wesley went for something. Cross all with a headbutt to the back of the head. And now Ricochet with the inverted crush. And now Cross trying to do something with Ricochet as a boot from Wesley. And Wesley going up to the middle rope. Looking for a haircut. Rana connects. Standing Moon saw no. Cross was able to move out the way. Cover on Ricochet and broken up by Wesley. And oh wait, oh I thought Ricochet hit a running blockbuster. 
That was a great job by Cross there. <clears throat> and now, Joe Gacy was looking for a chop. And Wesley looking for the cardiac kick on Joe Gacy. Hooks the leg. One, bro. Oh, wait, what? Oh, he locked the cross jacket in on cross. His own submission. Is he going to tap out? No, he doesn't. Oh, and a back elbow from Wesley. Tiger faint kick around the ring post. This has been a wild match. And now, oh, blocked by Wesley. And now Wesley going to work. Boom, with a combo of strikes. Jab, jab, kick, no. Counter by Gacy. Counter by Wesley. And now Wesley possibly looking to put things away right here. Why are you going to the outside, bro? You could have ended the match with another cardiac kick, bro. Oh, my gosh. Oh. Now looking for a backpack face buster. Oh. Oh my gosh, look at Gacy's face, bro. They made the blood so much better this year. My goodness. Like it has much more feel to it. That's Ricochet planting them again. I mean, it's been mostly Ricochet and Wesley throwing a detonation kick. What is Cross looking for? What the? Oh, my gosh. Tossing him into the ring post and just doing the same to Ricochet. I mean, this is not fair at all. Oh, my gosh, Cross. Completely unleashing. And now, oh! Snap Regal Plex there. Pump kick from Ricochet. Oh my gosh, man. And now, Alabama Slam. And now, oh, planning them. And now sending cross. And now cross sent back to the ring with Ricochet. Ricochet was possibly looking for that 630, but cross got back up to his feet. And a hair Conorana. Oh, stacks him up. Hooking the legs on Cross and Cross able to kick out. Oh, and a brain buster. Brain buster. And Cross was lighting up Ricochet for Wesley came in. Snapmare down, looking for hesitation. Drop kick, no. Cross able to get. Out of the way and then got caught with a spinning kick to the gut. Gacy whipping him into the corner. Oh, counter by oh, Wesley and delivers a pump kick. And Wesley telling Gacy to get back to his feet. Oh, and a full running forearm. Smash there to cross. Up to the outside on the apron. Did a Wesley sent crossing now. Oh, look for a little people's people's uh, moonsaw action, and Wesley got in the way of that. And now another brain buster. 
Wesley taking out Cross and there's the recoil. Hooks the leg and oh. At the right moment, Cross was able to to counter whatever Wesley was looking for. Ricochet looking for a 630. No. Oh, what a forearm smash there. And now Ricochet got him up again. Detonation kick. And another revolution knee, bro. How many, bro, how many superstars have this move in their arsenal? As Ricochet going over the top. And Wesley taking flight as well. Oh my goodness. Back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. And now a German. Ricochet dropping a knee. My gosh. This has been a wild tornado tag team match. Oh, a headbutt from Gacy. And now another detonation kick from Ricochet. Oh, Wesley ran right into Cross and got tossed. With a over the head belly to belly suplex. And now Cross looking for a power bomb off the floor. And Gacy sent into the post. All around the world, another tilt to world head scissors by Wesley. Another detonation kick. Ricochet, can you pick another move? Oh my goodness, man. And now, oh, Gacy sent. Back first. Right into the barricade and a back suplex on the floor. Oh my goodness, a forearm smash. From Wesley, it all went for a standing shooting star. Did Ricochet. And another tilt to world head scissors. Back and forth. No. No. Oh my gosh, what a close lap of cross. Oh my gosh, right into the LED board. Bro, this has just been unreal. EP dub, EP dub, EP dub, EP dub. That's what I would imagine the, the fans would be chanting right now. With this high action pack matches. You only get them here, here at EPW. Oh, what the heck was that? Ricochet pulling out new moves in that arsenal. And our springboard moonsault. No, Wesley ruined it. Oh no, look for a cross jacket. Cross jacket locked in. And Wesley able to break it up. And out the oh, hall, a German suplex. Oh, shot right to the gut. And our drop kick. Wesley. Working over the knee of, of Cross now. Kick to the goal. Oh, counter throw forearm smash. Oh, and a backbreaker. Dropping him right on the knee. And now, Joe Gacy. Alabama slam from Cross. Back elbow from Gacy. And now Joe Gacy possibly looking to put this match away. And Cross ruined it with a German suplex. For what reason did you have to ruin 
your own partner's spot that he was about to do, man. Send him to the corner. And Ricochet was able to counter momentarily. Hooking the leg. Oh. It was broken up. Oh, what a... Oh, DDT. Oh, what the heck? What the world? Oh, my gosh, bro. This match is so wacky, bro. Holy. Tag team wrestling. Oh, you're a Naki. From Gacy to Ricochet Snap Suplex. Tag team wrestling. Tag team wrestling. Ricochet. Recoil. And all oh, cross cut right back up. One, two. Oh my gosh. I don't know why Wesley didn't even try to go after Cross when Cross missed the first time. Back elbow from Cross. And what the heck is Cross looking for? Oh, ankle lock! Ankle lock locked in on Ricochet! Ricochet able to get out of it. And now Ricochet Irish whipping him. And oh! Drop kick somehow stayed on his feet and oh! Stacking him up after the haircut Rana! And a kick out from Cross. Oh my gosh, bro. Bro, this is the type of matches I live for, man. I love wrestling so much. Oh! I should probably do some wrestling reactions, too. And a standing moonsault and a springboard moonsault. Oh my gosh. This is what tag team wrestling is all about. Shooting star press from Ricochet. And a cardiac kick from the cardiac kid. And Chaos gets the dub in convincing fashion. Oh my goodness. That is how you make a statement. A wild finish to this match. And ladies and gentlemen, we're not done just yet. Nah, nah. We've got some more matches on the card. On to our next match. And here... We go. One on one match. Here comes the champ, accompanied by me, <laughs> the EPW United States Champion, Austin Theory. I've also taken him under my wing as well. You thought Austin Theory was unlikable in WWE? Oh boy, you haven't seen him here at EPW. Bro is finna get booed out the stadium. But he don't care. I don't care. It's business, man. It is all business, and Austin Theory is looking to take care of business tonight, but against who? Who would dare step up to Austin Theory, you might ask? But we're about to find out right now. Oh, ho, ho, ho. he's got a lot of dog in him. Braun Breaker is here in EPW.
He's looking to break somebody in half with a spear. This is Goldberg 2.0, man. Former breakout star in NXT, former NXT champion. <clears throat> I wonder when he's going to get called up to the main roster. Like Carmelo Hayes is getting called up this week. Braun Breaker looking to make a statement. And how big of a statement would it be if you were able to beat the champ in your first match in EPW, man? This is a huge match already. You're in episode one of EPW Neutron. Breaker excited to be here. And here we go. I believe, is this our first one-on-one -on -one match of the night? As Theory looking to, oh, already showing off his athleticism. And now Theory whipping him off the ropes. And by the way, I'm not playing any of these matches. Just let the CPU duke it out. As Theory looking for a power bomb on Braun Breaker. Able to counter it all. Planning Theory there. Oh, working over the arm now. And Theory able to counter whatever he was looking for next. And now just raining down the rights. And busting open. Wait, pause. Busting open Braun Breaker with that right hand. And oh my gosh, what a power bomb. Did you see the way Braun Breaker just bounced off the mat? Off the impact, man. This is a whole different Austin Theory. Oh, again, planning, the planning Breaker. And now Breaker's had enough. With the forearm smashes. And oh, Theory looking to plant him. Oh, and I close on. A phenomenal competitor both of these guys are. Sent back into the ring is Braun Breaker. And oh, and he was waiting for Theory there. Got him up. Looking for a stalling suplex here. Look at the power of Braun Breaker. Oh my gosh. Braun Breaker showing off again with the strength. Braun, oh, Braun Breaker. Oh, my goodness, taking fight. Tope Kahilo. And just taking over this match now is Braun Breaker. And I, I'll just ragdoll in theory. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, he is just tossing theory around. Oh my goodness, man. Theory needs to find some type of will here to get back in this match. Like right now, I was whipping him and planning him. That's exactly what you love to see. One. Oh. Oh my goodness, man. Planet him, fisherman driver. And now, got him up. A town down. A town down, and that may do it. One. Two, no. Now 
Theory on the ropes again. Now, Braun Breaker looking possibly for the end. Playing on military press into a power slam. Two. Oh, and Theory able to get the shoulder up. Breaker looking to break. Oh, he's looking to break Theory in half. And Theory. Looking to plant Breaker again across the knee. Hooks the leg. One, two, and Breaker got the shoulder up. Breaker wisely rolling out. Kick to the gut from Theory. Looking for a DDT on the floor. We've seen a lot of DDTs tonight. Breakers busted open. And plan it again. A spinning sidewalk slam and our drop kick. Picture perfect by Theory. And now Theory raining down the right. And now sending Breaker back into the ring. Theory looking to put this match away once and for all was oh looking for something and Breaker was able to counter and toss him there. Oh Breaker with the clothesline and Braun Breaker starting to feel it now. Big buck body dropping a spine buster. Kick to the back of Austin Theory. And now, Breaker going up to the middle row with a splash to the back of Theory. Hooks the leg. Will that do it? One, two, no. Theory able to get that shoulder up. Again, and a power bomb. Return the favor. Theory did that to him earlier. Could he possibly be looking for the Steiner recliner? No, he's picking him up. Oh, looking for another military. Oh, counter by Theory. And a oh, big right hand to the back. And, oh, and a kick right to the face from Braun Breaker. And Breaker charging in with a knee. Breaker looking to cut Theory in half. This would be huge right here for Breaker with this massive spear. Could that be it? One. Two, no, Theory able to get the shoulder up once again. And another knee strike. And now Breaker possibly looking for the military press slam. Again and again, Theory countering. Got him up. Oh, TKO. The jumping TKO in Theory. Looking to put it away. A town down. Hooked the leg. Two, you can count to a hundred. Because this match is over. Austin Theory gets the win. Another great back and forth match on the card. Man, I was not lying 
in the hype video that I posted. Nothing but action-packed matches on the show that is going to deliver each and every week. And I don't give a damn what bad things people have to say about it. We're on to the next match. Here comes the Poison Pixie herself, Candice LeRae. One of probably the most underrated and underappreciated women's superstars in professional wrestling. I think she deserves more love, man. I really do. Well, she's going to get a lot more love in this series. And so is this woman right here. Roxanne Perez. One of the upcoming superstars down there in NXT. She's been a star for some time. And now she can be a star here in EPW. Looking to make a name for herself here. Possibly when her first big time championship I, I i know she's she's won the NXT women's championship but that's not a big time championship it's not a, it's not a main card championship man it's a whole different ball game when you're talking about the main show here we go man Candice LeRae Roxanne Perez ready to mix it up in the middle of the ring. Candice didn't waste any time off the jump. Charging Roxanne Perez with a clothesline. Oh, well, she might have been looking for a springboard there. What the hell? Oh, a page turner off rip. Oh, my gosh, bro. Imagine if she would have beat her off a of page turner. Oh, oh Luthez press from Perez. And now Perez. Oh, showing off her athleticism. And oh, Candace playing possum, rolling her own small package. And now, oh, a little spinal tap there. Oh, close line. Now, boom, drop it. Oh, had her head in. What the heck, bro? I was her head in front of the top rope. And now, oh, Candice looked like she probably was looking for a DDT there. And now, Roxanne with a forearm smash. Kick to the gut and out, stomping her out. Looking for. That senton again, that corkscrew senton that she loves so well, apparently. Now, I don't think I've ever seen her do that in real life. As she's going to the top, Perezno. Oh, what the? Oh, <laughs> bro. Oh, a springboard poison rana. Oh my gosh. Candice LeRae ain't fucking around. Oh my goodness. Irish whip. Drop down. Lee Frog. Oh, delivers a single leg drop kick. To Perez. And now lighting her up and all Perez in trouble now because she's stunned. 
What is Candice looking for here? A little... Oh! Oh! Tornado DDT! Oh my goodness! Hooks the leg only gets a two count. Oh my goodness, man. This has been a pretty good match so far. As Candice LeRae looking, oh, looking for Wicked Stepsister. Can she connect? Bang! Face first goes Perez. Oh! Counter by Perez there. Russian leg sweep. What a Russian leg sweep. And again, going for that corkscrew senton. And Roxanne, Irish whipping her to the corner. What is she looking for? Oh, wait. There's a version of Pop Rocks? <laughs> Pop Rocks? <laughs> hooks, well, didn't hook the leg, but... Didn't get the job done. Going for a cross face. Locked in on Candice LeRae. Candice in trouble. And Candice able to get out of it. Irish whip drop down. Oh, another single leg drop kick from Candice LeRae. Kick to the gut. Look at for D D D. Back and forth, these two are going. A neck breaker from Candice. I could definitely see Candice being women's champion. In EPW as she delivers a knee on the money. And now, oh, Candice looking to fly, maybe. Looking to fly. Suicide. Oh, until a tornado day, day, day. Oh, my gosh, Candice Lorraine. This is why I said she's so underrated, bro, because she does that in real life. Holy smokes. <clears throat> Roxanne with the Luthes press again. Overhand chop. And now another one. Kip up from Candice. And now looking for Snake Eyes right onto the barricade. Face first she went. And Roxanne in firm control right now. A count of six. Candice trying to catch a breather. Oh, Roxanne telling her to get back in the ring. And she does. And locks in Black Widow. Or, or an octopus stretch. As Roxanne able to get out of it. Roxanne. Roxanne. As she's starting to feel it now. Cosine. That had some hype behind it. Holy. And now she's looking for Pop Rocks once again. Hooking the leg on Candice LeRae. Will that do it? No, it will not. Candice able to kick out. And now Irish Whip. Oh, Candice somehow was able to dodge from all the way back there. And now another cross face. Locked in on Candace. Candace has nowhere to go and has no choice but to tap out. Oh, we got a cutscene. Candace. A valiant. Whoa. Be what does Bianca Belair want with Candace Lorray? Oh, we've got a stare now here. Oh, this is going to be a banger come next week. Bianca Belair versus Candice LeRae is going to steal the show. But next week is not here yet. We're still on this week. And we're on to the next match. Here we go. Man, RIP Bray. I had to, I had to put him... 
in in this um in the um universe mode, man. Had to put him in EPW to carry on his legacy. I know we all miss him in the in the wrestling community, not just WWE, but the wrestling community in general. Bray was was a different a different type of vibe, man. I mean, everybody loved watching Bray. Bray was a great person inside and outside the ring. Just still crazy to see that he's he's gone, man. But in this universe mode, we're gonna keep his legend alive against the Yeet Master himself, Jay Uso. It's just me, Us. Day one, it's just me, Us. <laughs> Yeet. That gear is clean too. See, I wish, I wish, like, with the updates and stuff, I wish they would, they would add their new theme songs and new tri Titan Trons and all that. Like, I think that's one thing that that two K, that WWE two K is lacking. Is the the update? But if some changes or if they get like a new, new um, attire or something, they should put it in the game. As Bray tried for a running cross body, Jay was able to sidestep, and now Bray looking for Gore Buster, planted him. Oh, a snap elbow. I'm definitely gonna miss Bray's laugh though, bro. He had probably top five best laughs of all time. That was his laugh that I put at the end of the um EPW hype video. That is Jay working over the arm. Oh my goodness. Oh, And now, looking for the oh my goodness, a little modified gut buster there. Hooks the leg on Jay and a kick out. And now, Jay back in control now. Looking, tossing him. And now, Bray. Raining down the shots. Oh, step on his hand. Oh, stomping on the arm. Blocked the drop kick. It has been all Bray here in this match. As it should. Oh, planted him. Oh, possum. Possum, small package. And a kick out there. And now Jay in control now. Holy. And send him break to the outside. Oh, he just sat up. Oh. And sent back into the ring. It's Jay now. Oh, Jay getting a little jiggy with it. And delivered a crazy right hand. And now, what is Jay looking for next? Drop down. Oh, oh! And now, Jay looking at toss, Bray Wyatt there, and oh, 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 got right back up, just no sold it like it was nothing. Counter from Bray, oh, and a headbutt. Close went for a clothesline. Bray was able to block. And a headbutt right to the shoulder. 
And another one! Oh, what a right hand. And now, right, oh, looking to take out that leg of Jay. And I'm stomping a mud hole in him. Those drifter stomps. Hooking the leg on Jay, one, and I kick out. I definitely got to see who's under that, under that, um, Uncle Howdy mask. And now Sister Abigail from Bray Wyatt to Jey Uso and a kick out. Oh my gosh. Not many have kicked out of the Sister Abigail. And now, whoa, like he probably was going for the mandible. Caught a headbutt. You do not want to get headbutted by a Samoan. And now a Samoan drop. From Jay. Spine Buster. Shout out to Dwayne The Rock Johnson. And now oh, Uncle Howdy getting involved. Distracting Jay to buy Bray some time. Oh, and it didn't work. Because Jay is still in control. And delivers a neck breaker. And another Samoan headbutt. Boom. Kneeling jawbreaker there. Going up top. Looking to get a little ooh so crazy with the splash. Hooks the leg on Bray and a kick out. And Uncle Howdy again getting involved. Kick to the gut. And Bray back in control just like that in a pop-up punch. A pop-up punch. And Uncle Howdy throwing a chair in the ring. What they got going on? I just noticed Bray's got a... Is that a knee brace? And the ref throwing out the chair. And just stomping out the hand of Jey Uso. Oh, and now... You don't want to head put a Samoan, but Bray really, really doesn't care. Oh, he's looking for a right hand. Need a gut. Mandible call. Locked in. Oh. The mandible claw hooks the leg on Jay, and he's able to get the shoulder up. Unreal. And now a Yuranagi. I would have loved to see this match one on one in real life, man. And now old Bray going out in the apron. Oh, and it delivers a forearm shot. And Jay back to his feet. Oh, and oh my, that's what that's what Roman does. That little taunt right there, and Uso gonna make him pay. He probably doesn't really care. And oh. And again, Uncle Howdy getting involved. Oh my gosh, bro. And Bray back to his feet. I mean, this is not fair. This is a three on one. Where is Cody? Where is Sammy? Where is Seth? When you need him. Oh my goodness, and he's throwing the one to the sky. He hasn't done that since he turned on the bloodline. And now, oh, just running right through him with that cross body. Oh! Oh, man! About to break the neck of Jey Uso. And now looking 
Oh, Ripcord Lariat. And now Bray. Oh, delivering a big boot. Oh, this is vintage Bray right here. Do the please do the spider crawl. Yeah. The spider crawl. This is where Bray is at his creepiest. Look at the bro, look at his locks, bro. They look so stiff like that. Jay doesn't know where he's at. Bray looking to put his finishing touches on this match. Looking for Sister Abigail. Kiss goodnight. Hooks the leg, and that may be all. She wrote no. Jay somehow kicked out, and another mandible claw, and this might be it. Jay may be out. One, two, three, and Bray Wyatt gets the win. Oh my goodness. What a match. That was the first Sister Abigail right there. A another Uso splash. Uso with the hip. He probably would have had the match won right there if it wasn't for Uncle Howdy. And then Bray able to make Jay pass out and get the win. Man, oh, man. This, not, this night ain't over yet. We still got, I think, a couple more matches left. Moving on to the next match. And here we go, ladies and gentlemen. Our first main event in EPW history. This is a big one, too. I don't think these two have um, had a match together in real life. I'm not 100% sure. But this will for sure just sell out so quickly. If these two step in the ring together, you're going to find out exactly who I'm talking about right now. Who is it? Could it be? It's Adam Cole, baby! The EPW World Champion. Adam Cole, baby. And this... Probably the biggest match you'll ever see, man. Two of the greats, two of the best in-ring performers and entertainers ever in professional wrestling. Adam Cole is one of my favorite superstars in WWE down at NXT. It sucks that they didn't push him up to the main roster with the Undisputed Era. And he just, just didn't renew his contract. Um... I absolutely hate AEW, so I, I'm not going to just watch AEW just to see him. Just wait for him to come back to WWE, which is likely now that Triple H is in charge. But Adam Cole, man, had phenomenal matches in NXT with Johnny Gargano, Finn Balor, Tommaso Ciampa, Aleister Black, and tons more. Seth Rollins, that match they had on, on Raw. I don't think we've ever seen Adam Cole versus Will Ospreay. Here we go, ladies and gentlemen. This is the main event. Oh, springboard dropkick from Will Ospreay. Flying Mayorana. And they're kicking this one off hot and heavy. As is a hair con Rana. It's been all Will Ospreay here. Neckbreaker. Please don't be a squash match. Oh, Cole. Oh, Cole. What an answer. 
a little springboard forearm action there. Oh, and now Will Ospreay back in control now. The neck breaker. And now Irish whip off the ropes and delivers a rocket kick. And Will Ospreay all just baiting in Adam Cole. Oh, no. Oh, no. We know where this is going. No, please don't. Oh, okay. I thought it was about to be a lot worse. I thought he was going for a powerbomb on the apron. Holy, that would have been catastrophic. Oh, I'm sent right into the steps. Especially for our world champion, man. We do not need him getting injured. And now, oh! That Gore Buster GT, yes, and now forearm. Forearm strike from Adam Cole, Bay Bay. And sent all oh, just giving his receipt right there. Sending him into the steps, and Adam Cole is feeling it. And Adam Cole doesn't care how he wins. Count of eight. Count of nine. Osprey back into the ring, able to beat the count of ten. Oh, and delivers a right. Adam Cole. Springboard forearm smash. And Cole always oh, looking for a last shot already. Will Osprey able to counter into a standing moonsault. And a standing shooting star. He is such an athlete, bro. That match that him and Kenny Omega had, oh my, beautiful. Chef's kiss. And another hair Rana stacks him up. And a kick out. And now Osprey starting to feel it now. And Osprey with the clothesline. Another one. Another one. Bowen with leg sweep. And Will Osprey is fired up. Hooks the leg on Adam Cole, and a kick out. Osprey couldn't believe it. As Osprey going for something, caught and planted with the power slam from Adam Cole. And now Cole, Irish whipping him into the corner. Cole, all okay, kick to the knee, looking for it. Panama Sunrise. Hugs the leg on Will Ospreay. Two and Ospreay able to get the shoulder up. And Ospreay rolling out and Cole. Oh, is he looking to fly too? Look out. Over the top. Oh, since when is Adam Cole doing tope con helos? Somersault plancha, however you want to call it. And now working over the knee to stop the high, fast pace, Will Ospreay. And now sending Ospreay back into the ring. Oh, back to his feet. Oh, miscalculated that there. And Cole dropping him on the back of his neck with the backdrop suplex. And now raining down the left. And now Adam Cole went for a chop, counter by Osprey. Standing Spanish fly. Kick to the back. And another kick to the back. And oh, Will Osprey is feeling it. Osprey, but that's a Leo Del Sol. Hooks the leg one. Two and a kick out, Adam Cole. Sticking around in this match. Oh, what a right hand. I think we might have saw a tooth go flying out there from Adam Cole. And oh, a little stunner, mini stunner there. And both men on the outside. Now and a snap, DDT. And boom, again. And back into the ring. Oh, Osprey. 
they had a little mini stare down right there. Oh no. Oh oh no and oh Adam Cole able to counter it this time. Now I think that time he was actually trying to pop him on the apron a scoop slam. On the floor, I went for a chop kick. And back into the ring. Sent Adam Cole. And oh, Cole went for something. Oh! Code breaker there. And Irish whip into the corner. What is Osprey thinking here? Oh, no. Oh, no. Pulling out all the stops. Pulling out all the stops. Oh, what a counter! Adam Cole! Planet Osprey kick to the knee. Looking for the last shot. Got it. It connects. Hooks the leg. Will that be it? Two. No. Will Osprey kicked out? Nobody's ever kicked out of two. Another last shot. That's it. You can count to a thousand. No one's kicking out. And Will Osprey has now kicked out of two last shots back-to-back. -back. Unbelievable. And now Adam Cole, I think he's had enough. He's still playing around, looking to put this match away. Panama Sunrise one more time. And he's, he's not done. He's making sure. Oh, and maybe he got a little too greedy there. Maybe he should have just pinned him. He got a little too greedy, a little too cocky. And Will Ospreay ran right into Cole and ate a chop. And now playing it with a power bomb. Oh, my goodness. And now, oh, face first off the turnbuckle and a chop. And just working over the arm. Oh, went for another chop. Oh, kick to the gut. Flying Mayorana. Osprey picking Cole back up. Another Salina Dalsol. This time grabs both legs. And oh, Cole able to kick out again. Oh my goodness. This match has lived up to the billing. Working over the arm now is Will Ospreay. And what is he looking for here? Oh, kick to the gut. What the heck? Oh! Back stabber from the top rope. Hooking the leg on Adam Cole. And a kick out. Able to get the shoulder up once again. And another standing shooting star press. Another one. Oh. Maybe that's one too many there. Tried to go back to the well. One too many times. And a super kick. Florida Keys. And that may be it right there. Bridges out. And a kick out. And Cole. Looking for a third last shot counter. Another Salida Del Sol. Hooking the legs. One Two, and Adam Cole kicks out again. Osprey, Hurricanrana. Running Hurricanrana from Osprey, and another Salida Del Sol. That's got to do it. To beat the champion, and Cole kicks out again. What do you have to do from the top of Splash? Maybe that will do it. There's two and another kick out. Oh, and Cole. 
Oh my goodness, bro. Back and forth. These two going. Oh, double knees to the back. Oh, what the heck? <laughs> Handspring into a head scissors takeover. A tilt toward head scissors is what I meant. Oh my gosh. And now Cole picking up the pace now, doing exactly what Will Ospreay did earlier. And another sweep. Cole hooking the legs now. One, two, and a kick out again. These two back and forth. This is definitely match of the night. Kick to the knee again. Another Panama Sunrise. Kip up. Are you kidding me? He just no sold a Panama Sunrise. Oh my gosh. Hook the leg on Adam Cole. And Adam Cole gets the shoulder up again. Went for a calf kick. Cole with a counter. Kick to the knee. And this is a third last shot. That's got to do it. One, two, three. And Adam Cole wins an absolute bar burner here in the main event of EPW Neutron. But he's not done. What is he? What is he looking for? Oh no! Oh no! No, Cole, you already won the match. There's no need for this, man. There's no need for this. Wait! Oh, Dragon Lee! Dragon Lee with the save! Oh my gosh! What does Dragon Lee have to do with this, though? Oh my gosh. Well, ladies and gentlemen, the future is officially here. EPW has officially arrived. Thank you guys for watching this video. Hope you guys enjoyed episode one of EPW Neutron. But this is not the only show that we have at EPW. There is another show EPW Electro Knights. Electro, yeah, Electro Knights will be will be uploaded right after this video right here. It will be the next WWE 2K23 video. But I hope you guys enjoyed. Smash that like button. Um, subscribe to the channel if you're new. Turn on my post notifications so you get notified whenever I drop another banger video like this. Man, bro, I gotta rest my voice. That, bro, this this show took a lot out of me. I've recorded for two hours now. But, man, I really enjoyed this. Hope you guys enjoyed. And without further ado, I'm out.